But here in Prague, food is really easy to come by and it's really inexpensive. So that's a nice plus when coming here. Uh, you can go shopping and get everything you need to eat for the week very cheaply. And even when you go out to restaurants, it's not very expensive. You're not going to be paying ridiculous amounts of money for what you buy. Uh, as far as typical foods, you can pretty much find in the grocery stores most of the same kinds of foods you'd find in America, uh, minus some maybe specialty American things uh, like Pop-Tarts or like boxed macaroni and cheese. Uh, you won't find a lot of that preservative filled stuff here in Prague. But when you go to the restaurants, the restaurant food is a lot of bread and meat and their food is really heavy. It's delicious, but you kind of miss a few of the major food groups. So one of my recommendations and you know pro tips for if you come here to Prague is to make sure that you get all of your nutrients in and you're not just eating out at restaurants all the time. Before coming to Prague when we were filling out all the applications and everything, we were given a couple of options as to how we wanted to house ourselves in Prague. We could live in some of the recommended dormitories or we could find a flat or apartment uh, off campus and uh, figure out rooms for ourselves. But I live in the Masarykova dormitory, which is one of the biggest dormitories for CTU from what I've seen. And it houses a lot of other exchange students. So you're always going to find people walking around uh, speaking in English. And it's really nice because the dormitories themselves are pretty clean. They're pretty well put together. They have all of the you know, required anemones, they have places for you to cook, they have good showers and restrooms, and it's just really easy to find someone there to talk to. I share my flat with five other people. I have one roommate, and then there's two more rooms with two people. One of my roommates is from the United States as well, and then I have two from Spain, one from Russia, and one from France. So it's been really cool getting to room with people from all over the world, essentially, and you know, we talk about like their food and we actually have signs all over our room with how to say phrases in different languages from like people who just like stop by our room, just like right on our, our walls, but it's paper that we plastered up and it's, it's been a really cool experience to just meet a bunch of people from different countries in our dorm building because there's so many international students living there.